Dearly beloved, we are gathered together here in the sight of God and in the face of this company to join together this man and this woman in holy matrimony. You are super supportive of my dreams and I truly believe you have my bike no matter what the circumstance. <laughs> the circumstance. You let me be me and that's all I can really ask for. As I thought of all the perfect things to say for my vows, I realized for the first time I really didn't have anything to say at all, um, at least not perfect enough. To show you or express just how much I love you or how much I love this life with you. You can accept me through all my flaws, all my snoring through the night, all my falling asleep on every show we watch. Yes. Eating all your fries on the bag on the way home. <laughs> Thank you for being such an amazing father to our babies and for letting me into a heart that you tried to guard for years. Thank you for the kind of love I never knew I quite needed. The kind of love that only you could ever give to me. The kind that really drives me insane, almost as insane as when you snore at night. But you balance me and you make it so easy to promise that I'll try to always be patient. That one will work on for a lifetime. No, dealing with me is not the easiest. Everyone. Anyway. <laughs> but you do it so effortlessly. You also gave me my two babies and I'll forever be grateful. And two babies and that's it. <laughs> Just like Andre 3000 says, you are my prototype, and I got you. By the power invested in me, from the God, the Father, the Holy Ghost, and the Son, three in one, I now pronounce you man in white. We love you, sweetheart. Never ever felt like we would lose a daughter to Quilla because we haven't lost a daughter. We've gained a son. With that being said, I want to really stress the fact you have a family. And family is so important. In fact, God created the family before he created the church. So always cherish and do what you have to do to hold your family as one. That being said, congratulations, I love you. Won't you look at how we come alive? And I just want y'all to be happy, happy, happy. It's not gonna be happy all the time. So let's go. the way that she deserves. I'm so happy for you guys, and I wish you a lifetime of happiness. Always keep God first and do it your way. Whatever works for you guys, I love you. Dude is, is, is the epitome of a, of a family man. That's the irony of it all. Watching him with his daughter, watching him run around and make decisions just to make sure Asia is happy. He's a great father, a great husband, and he won't show you and he don't want y'all to know, but he's a great person.